Pure Petrol with um, Easy Peasy Creative Ideas and today I'm going to show you how I remove uh, serger stitches. Um, did you know that um, removing serger stitches is basically just as easy as removing regular stitches? Well, it is and I'll show you how. I know um, dealing with a serger can be a little intimidating, especially when you have to thread the serger or um, try when you're trying to hide um, all those ugly tails. I've already done a tutorial on um, how to hide uh, serger tails without uh, snipping or uh, tucking or just hand sewing. So um, check it out. If you take a look at the serger stitches, they might be looking a little um, intimidating, quite scary. But if you take a very close look, you will realize it's actually really, really simple to remove them once you got the secret all sorted out. Let's take a closer look at the serger machine and the stitches and how they, they join and um, they form the loops. I'm uh, working with the Brother 103040 and um, my uh, serger stitches are made um, with four threads. Um, these little um, wheels here. Um, the yellow one is for the left needle. The right, uh, the the pink one is for the right needle. The green one is for the upper loops, and the blue one is for the lower loops. And let's see how they look on um, on the fabric. So let's see the stitches. So. Um, these are the stitches formed by the left needle and these are the stitches formed by the right needle and um, these loops are the upper loops and on the back we'll have the lower loops The lower loops and the upper loops, they just join on the, on the edge here. But the secret is they are kept um, together on the fabric by the left needle and the right needle stitches. So once we, we get this removed, everything else will just fall off right away. So how do we remove the left needle and the right needle stitches? You notice these loops form a little V here, here, and here, and here, and everywhere. So we're just gonna go through this, one of these Vs and we're gonna um, catch the left and right uh, stitches. Pull a little bit. And then just, um, just cut the, the left, the left um, stitches first. And then I'm just gonna grab one of these tails. And I'm going to pull as much as it will let me. Well, I managed to pull the whole thread on one side and then let's do the the second second tail and I just pull the thread as much as it will let me
success. I managed to take out um, the whole thread. If it breaks while you're pulling, that's not an issue. You just do the thingy again with the seam ripper. You just cut the, the thread again and repeat the steps. And now it's time to do the right uh, needle thread, which is this one. I'll just uh, cut it with my seam ripper and then pull. Just as I did with the left needle thread. And with those threads out of my way, the loops are just so easy to remove. Ta-da! All done! So uh, that's it. That's pretty much how you uh, remove the serger stitches in just a few simple and easy steps. I hope you enjoyed this uh, tutorial and um, I would love to know your thoughts. So please leave a comment down below. And if you like my channel, uh, please subscribe and like and uh, share. And see you next time. Thank you! Thank you.